Ewan. Yo. Hello. Hi. You like puzzle games, right? Uh, it's a puzzling fact, but yes. All right. Uh, who am I? I look most like this. Perfect. It's Ginger, just like you are. <laughs> of course. With the heavy mascara. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I get quite a few cat calls, but you know. It's the long hair that does it. Yeah. So this is a puzzle game using computer programming logic. <laughs> Welcome to your first day. You look like an excellent instruction follower. Your first job will appear around the right seat. Remember, you can always ask me for help. Okay. Drag commands into this area to build a program. Your program should tell your worker to grab things from the inbox and drop to the outbox. Okay. It walks. Outbox. Go! Wow. Okay. Oh. Uh, mm. Do I need to get more? <laughs> Hooray. What inefficient code. Eh. There we go. I don't want to spoil it for you. I have played through this game. All the way? Uh, more or less. Harsh. When I got stuck, I went on to the Steam forums and got the solution. Just so I can get the achievements. Okay. Whoa. Those are some yucky fingernails. I hate the long fingernails. How do you scratch your... This is the same studio that does uh, Little Inferno and uh, World of Goo. Mm. So the art style may seem familiar to you. I've played a little bit of World of Goo. Have you? Yeah, just a little bit. Grab each thing from the aim of the jump. You can drag jump arrows to jump to different lines within your probe. This ability can assign using only three commands total. In box. Mm -hmm. Out box. Mm -hmm. Jump. Jump to where? To beginning. Here. Hooray. Okay, this is going to take a year. You're genius. What am I spelling? I don't even know. Did you ever go to a spelling bee as a kid? No. Neither did I. Wait, no, I did it once. Um, our high school was like broke most of the time, so we didn't get stuff like that. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I participated once, and I got a much harder word than the person before me. I should close the window. Close the window? Yeah, neighbors are out, uh, moving boxes. Facility has placed some items over there on the carpet for you. I'm going to pick them up. Okay. Ignore More the nice inbox for now and just send the following three letters to the outbox. Yep. Bug. Bug. Okay. So. Uh -huh. Ignore the inbox. Copy from. No. Delete that. Copy from B. Copy from U. Copy from G. Outbox. 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 Let's see. White. Gum. Hooray. Perfect. This is a nice little program logic here. Well, I'm assuming it gets much, much harder. This is only the tutorial. Yes. The system is fixed, and just in time for you to get to work. The data won't collate itself. Grab the first two things from the inbox and drop them into the outbox in the reverse order. Repeat until the inbox is empty. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh -huh. So, inbox. Then copy two zero K and then inbox again to outbox and then copy from zero to outbox. Let's see what that does. 
so put it down there. Wait. What? Not enough stuff in the Yeah, I know, I know, but it's doing what I wanted. Okay. <laughs> it's doing what I wanted. You just didn't jump in. Yeah. Uh, give me. Jump. All the way up here. Let's go. Wait, no, 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 no. No, that's not gonna work. What do you mean? Because I need to... Wait, no, no, no. Yeah. Huh. So I did get it right. Yeah. That's also the most efficient way to do it. Uh, I've played a, a similar game to this where you build, like, battle bots, and you gotta program your AI using stuff like this. Mm. Yeah, I used to do a little bit of uh, coding, but not very much. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Did a little bit work, in everyone. high school, because we had a... I guess it was sort of a game-making class, kind of. It was just a computer class, and everyone was like, yeah, we'll make games, I guess. <laughs> so everybody agreed, and the teacher was like, okay, I'll change the curriculum to that. Nice. Yeah. Highest mark in the class, baby. I started on uh, Visual Basics 7, because that's all they can afford to teach us. Mm -hmm. And then on, on my own, I learned how to do a little bit of JavaScript and C++. Mm. That's as far as I got, just a hobby stuff. Yeah, I learned some C++, but not very much. I had to do it with uh, a code writing program that could not detect the errors. Oh, yeah. But there was another one we didn't have the license for that if you open it up, you could see what errors there were. <laughs> So I go between the programs to figure out which one was the error in the code, and then nice. go from there. Okay, for each two things in the inbox, add them together, and put the result in the out box. You've got a new command. It adds the content of a tile on the floor to whatever value you're currently holding. Okay, so for each two things in the inbox, add them together, and put the result. So, inbox. Yep. Copy two. Zero. And then, how many things are we putting in? Six? Okay, and then, inbox, add, zero. Okay, and then, copy from, zero. So that should put that there. Go back, put that there, add them together. There you go. Okay, and then I don't want to repeat the code because it'll take the input and it'll add it onto that, and we don't want that. So we are going to, can we copy and paste? Your program is not copying, try pasting it into other rooms or, but I could just, no, Ugh, I can't just add the code again god dang it no you have it right just jump it just jump it are yeah. you sure oh, yeah. i don't think it's right no you just didn't uh, I put didn't. it on the o yeah copy from there. now run it now run it let's go what oh your addition screwed up yeah, that's what I'm saying. Okay, so. Inbox, copy to zero. Inbox, add to zero. I, I recommend just playing it at a normal speed and see what it does. Okay, so. Put the five down. Perfect. Yeah. Put the five down. Add. Okay. Okay, okay. Instead of copy so, from, just delete copy from. Yeah. Just delete copy from. Yeah. Now let's try. Add those together. Sweet. Sweet. Holy moly. I did it. We did it, thank you. We did it, yes. You are my debugger. <laughs> Gross. Now quit debugging me. You're six. Okay. Which one do I go to? I'm guessing the blue one? Yep. The other ones are just uh, bonus stuff. Challenging ones. Mm -hmm. Where do you see yourself in five or ten years? Well, 
probably not standing right here. Okay, from this point on, your performance will be al evaluated with extra scrutiny. What a treat. Scrutiny. Send all things that are not zero to the outbox. You got a new command. If the value you're holding is zero, okay. So, all things that are not zero. Inbox. To. Out. No, you so, have it right. Are you sure? Yes. Inbox to outbox. Jump. Back, back to inbox. To yeah. Inbox of zero. That's the shortest you can make. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you forgot to jump yeah, it at the end. Yeah, you forgot to jump it at the end. Got to do another jumper. It expects you to do a whole bunch of, like, copying onto that table. That's a lot of work. Yeah, it is. Uh, I mean, you could do that. Oh. Oh, cool. Yeah. Sweet. Oh. That was efficient. Mm hmm All right. It gets harder. Okay. It's come to our attention that the Zero Advocacy community felt the previous assignment was not inclusive. This time, send only zeros to the outbox. What happens to the other numbers and letters? Management leaves that detail up to you. Okay. So do the same thing you just in did, box. but in reverse. To outbox. Um, so, go for an inbox. So, only if it's a zero, put it in the outbox. Yeah. Okay. You can do it with two jump commands, by the way. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just working through it. My brain just all of a sudden went, <laughs> I'm running on like four hours sleep, so. Okay, so inbox. Uh -huh. Shut up, again. Don't tell me what to do. Inbox to outbox. Inbox. Inbox, you take it out. If we go to outbox, go back to zero. Mm. Uh, my brain is <laughs> dying. Okay, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I, I got it, I got it. Go back to that one, and then we need one more jump. Jump. Give me the jump. Back up to there. Yeah. Oof. What? But Okay, okay, okay. You silly bad. So, mm -hmm. we go to inbox. If it's zero, we jump back. Uh, so if inbox, jump to that. Just play it at normal speed and see what it does. So we're taking it. It's not zero. Take it. It's zero. Go to outbox. Go back to inbox. Take it. Not a zero. Why? Hmm. Not as zero, so I go back to inbox, mm -hmm. and then I pick up the other one. <laughs> I need to make another jump. I'm fairly certain you can solve it with what you have there. Okay. 
Uh, so we need to jump back. Mm -hmm. So. Go to the inbox. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Clear that. Okay, okay. We're clearing it. We're clearing it. Yes. So put your inbox and outbox. Okay. We start here. Mm -hmm. Go there. Perfect. Inbox, outbox. But that's not what we want. So. So if, put your jump if zero between inbox and outbox. Yes. And now put a regular jump right after the first jump if zero that points back to your inbox. Okay. Now play it. I, oh, hold on. Holding on. Put another jump at the very end. Yeah, like there the you beginning. go. Keep forgetting that one. Okay. Yeah. The end one is always a little annoying. Okay. Yeah, do you understand? Yes. <laughs> that one was a little <laughs> trickier. Oh no. Uh, I think this is going to be your last one for this game. You think so? Yes. Sub hallway. Okay. Con considering you couldn't solve that one at your current condition. Subtraction. I never learned that in school. Did you? We're a good team. For each two things in the inbox, first subtract the first from the second. And the result in the outbox. And then subtract the second from the first and put the result in the outbox. Yep. Okay. <laughs> that is a long set of instructions. So, inbox. Mm -hmm. Just copy two. Just a heads up, you're going to be using all those um, squares in the middle. Yeah. Okay. okay. Um, so first from the second, so we need the second one here, uh, second from the first, so we will copy two, <laughs> number one, because uh -huh. that's the first number, goes there, second number will be subtracted from it, and then added there, we need to place the other one, so we'll just go back to inbox, copy to this one so I'll put that one there that one there and then subtract it from that one let's see what that does so grab that one put it down perfect grab that one put it down subtract yep. okay First phase done. So then, from there, we. Which one was that? So I subtracted the you wanna second from the first, so I want to do that in opposite, right? You want to put your subtracted product to your outbox first. Yeah. I want to make sure this is the right way around. Cause subtract the first from the second. So I place down the first. Place down the second, and then second and first, and then put that in the outbox. Yeah. Put this. Shall I grab it? Put it down. I grab that one. Put it down. Subtract that. Okay. So I got the right value. Yep. And then let me enter stuff. Jeez. So. Then we go copy from that one, subtract from that one, and then to outbox. Mm -hmm. So that's first one we take out, second one we take out, and then repeat. I think so. Okay, let's see if this works. Assuming you have it in the right order. Yeah, I might not have it in the right order, but it says the value is correct. Yep, alright. Sweet! Why was that one easier? Hmm. <laughs> Less thinking? I guess. And then are we gonna get absolute values? No. Okay, thank God. No rounding involved. Use ten or fewer commands. 
Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Perfect. The way they intended. Holy moly. All right, so this will be the last one. I thought it would take you longer. <laughs> sometimes some numbers are bigger than other numbers, and sometimes they are the same. How can we know? I read about in a great book. Which numbers are you? Aspirational. Blah blah blah. So, get two things from the inbox. If they are equal, put one of them yep. in the outbox. Discard non-equal pairs. Repeat. Yeah, you can do comments there. Oh, okay. It's deleting that one. Okay. Good job. So, if inbox. Copy to this one. Then inbox copy to number two. Okay. That way we have two values. Mm -hmm. If they are equal, put one of them in the outbox. So no, those no. are not equal. Put them there. How can I make? I was gonna say. Sure notice how they don't have any greater than, less than, or equal to. They have no comparatives. Yes. So. So you're gonna have to do some math. Mm -hmm. Subtract. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to have to do quite a process here because I gotta go here, <laughs> take that there, subtract the one from that one. Okay. Continue on, subtract from the other one, continue on. If any of them are zero, then just go back to the very beginning. Mm. So, copy two, copy two. And then we will go copy from one, subtract. Zero. No. Other way around. Down. Okay. Jump. Okay. Zero. Up to here, because I'm assuming that it's going to work that way. Okay. And then copy from two. Copy two. Copy from zero. Copy from one. Subtract from zero, jump a zero all the way back up. Okay. And then mm -hmm. copy from zero and then out box. Jump. I think this will work. We'll see. So copy it there. Perfect. Copy Your it there. Your program has to be much larger, by the way. Subtract. Subtract. Hmm. Okay. So just to let you know, it wouldn't have worked anyway, because you have both positive and negative numbers on your okay, feed. Okay, okay. <clears throat> so... So you have to do one set of instructions for positives. Mm. And then one set of instructions for negatives. Then compare mm. those together. Okay. <laughs> it's difficult. This is going to be the longest one. The longest one. Okay. Yeah. So. How can we make sure that the values we get are zero or equal? Okay. I, I will give you another six minutes. Six minutes? Yep. Oh no. For just this one puzzle. Okay. I'm gonna clear this. Mm -hmm. So. Inbox. Copy two. One, zero. Go. Inbox. Copy two. One. Okay. So. Then the only way we could get zero is if the values are the same. Can I write you two little 
Okay, okay. I, I think I've got it. I think I've got it. So, copy from zero, and then we will do subtract from one. Okay. So, inbox, we copy it there. Go back, take the other one. There. We subtract. Then, if it's zero, then we jump to Hoba. No, then we have to go back and grab the other one, then take it to the outbox. So, and then copy from, doesn't matter which one. Okay. But if it's not zero, we want to copy from zero add to one and then we do jump there jump zero to there to there let's just try this out so put it there it's not gonna work just hold on hold on I'm, I'm watching all yeah. right so we add it together now then Grab that one, that one. We add it. Zero. Now five. Okay, and then we jump all the way back. Perfect. I got this. Eh. Yeah. Easy peasy. Also wrong. Here, I'll give you some inputs that cause your solution to fail, so you can see for yourself. Okay. So what are the inputs that would cause it to fail? Three plus three. Okay, what's the input that'll cause it to fail? Zero. Okay. That's what it is. <laughs> okay. That's what's the problem. If there's a zero in the system. Okay. So, <laughs> if it's a zero, uh -huh. that's the issue. All right. So. Uh, the two minutes, by the way. Two minutes? Oh no. So I got the solution, but not the right solution, because there's one exception for if it's a zero. So if it is a zero, then I shouldn't go all the way back there. Um, if the final number is zero, <laughs> <laughs> then we go all the way back up here. Let's go! Okay. Okay, no. Let's undo that thing. <laughs> so this one's a naughty one. Okay, okay. So. Let's try it. Jump if zero. <laughs> no, because then if there's two zeros. Crap. Okay. That would be interesting, though. So, say there's two zeros, it would automatically do the right thing. You're if overthinking. There's one zero. You are overthinking, I'm overthinking this. Yes. Okay. What is the final solution to this? You just want me to tell you an answer? Yes. So. Well, first off, this is you can't salvage this, by the way. Ah. Yeah. Okay. Your 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 final thing is going to be way more complex than this. Really? Yes. Okay. You have, oh, you have to have one more thing here. You need one specific spot that does addition and one specific spot for subtraction. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. This is why you have comments. To keep track of 
how long this thing is gonna be. Okay, okay. If that makes any sense. Well, you're out of time, by the way. I understand the gist of it, though. So, thanks for watching. The thanks. Eh. Perfect. Oh, you must eh. be pretty tired. All right. <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. Goodbye. Bye bye.